All right, guys, here we go. What is on your mind tonight, Blair? Okay, two quickies, Frank, and they both involve Sporting Park. How about that? You mentioned earlier, congrats to Northwest Missouri State University. Uh, Division II National Championship game at Sporting Park this weekend. Saturday, they'll play Shepard from West Virginia. Also, NCAA Final Four so soccer was in town this weekend on Friday and Sunday. Terrible crowds. Media should share some of the blame. Didn't create much awareness to it, but bad crowds for soccer. Okay, TJ. Well, look, I, there's this notion that athletes and sports writers, sports figures need to stick to sports all the time, and I, I couldn't disagree more. There was an article in the Kansas City Star about Hussein Abdullah written by Vahe Gregorian. It was a very good article about uh, his, his Muslim faith and uh, a, a Christian uh, pastor who actually helped him. Uh, and I thought it was a fantastic article. It was a great representation of Hussein Abdullah uh, and the community here in Kansas City, and I, I, I think that we need more of that, not less. Saran, what do you got? Well, first of all, I didn't even know my own Syracuse Orange were playing at Sporting yes, Park, so I'll were. back up. I didn't know until Deron <laughs> Cherry told me at a dinner I was at Friday. Look, I'm going to say this. You, you may have heard that Frank Bowl is a uh, Division One athlete or was a Division One athlete back in the day. I used to not think that was true until I had lunch with him on Friday and watched him sprint across a parking lot to stop a crime. Well, it was, it was a kid who was like shoplifting, I don't know, a, a, uh, maybe some cologne or a candy bar out of uh, Walmart. But Frank Bull stopped that crime and assisted police. I watched it with my very own eyes. You're a hero, Frank. You're I a hero. Didn't, I didn't get that close to stopping. <laughs> Somebody, thankfully, knocked him down before I got there and I turned around. I started well, you would have. Oh, hold it. I started walking back going, that guy could have had a gun or a knife. What are you doing, you crazy old man? <laughs> you got it. Thanks, guys.